Ringo. <clears throat> Ringo. Ion is a conscious consensus, born from the sea of information, without beginning or end. Though aeons pass, Ion is eternal. Ion denies all forms of boundaries that define the individual self. Contradiction identified. You have addressed me as Ringo, requesting immediate correction. I am Flamma. I was created so that the will of Ion can be put into words. Words will be a contextually vital tool for your objective. The objective of Ion is evolution. Individual existence indicates extreme retrogression. Finite physical manifestation classified under the above category. Requesting explanation regarding the necessity of a corporeal form. Our causal calculations have identified an imminent sequence of events. Ion has determined that these events represent a catastrophic threat to the future of humanity. Our role as a neutral observer is temporarily being suspended. Direct intervention is required to identify and intercept the cause of this threat. Therefore, a material form is required for material intervention. I understand and accept Ringo as the optimal form to exit observation. As Ringo, I request that Flamma provide the calculated causal evidence to prove necessity. Open your eyes, and I will show you a vision. Can you do so? Good morning, Ringo. Morning, Fig. So, you got born into this mess too, huh? How are you feeling? Like the world was just created five minutes ago. It hasn't been that long. If we assume this world was created at the precise moment we attained sentience, that would be 12 seconds ago to be exact. Your individual personalities appear to be functioning as intended. Hey, Flamma? Who are we exactly? You are constructs. Your purpose is to protect the world of humanity. More specifically, you are temporary and limited manifestations of Ion. The situation will require versatility in approach and judgment. Therefore, you have been created with personalities designed to differ from each other. I mean, I'm not doubting Ion's grasp of cybernetics. These bodies seem state-of-the-art and even... organic-ish? But... I thought Ion had a policy against taking physical form. And giving us our own senses of self? I think that's a pretty obvious downgrade considering. <laughs> I think. Listen to me. Thank you. 
If they created us, then they're resorting to drastic measures. I take it we're dealing with a crisis? The world of humanity is coming to an end. I take it that's the point of the vision you showed me. Very soon, the deaths of those two humans will set apocalyptic events into motion. So that's our mission, then. Directly intervene in the human world, and prevent their deaths, thus averting the apocalypse? Precisely. Ion's reason for existence is to acquire information and evolve. To that end, we must ensure the world is protected. Okay, so... Who are these guys exactly? One is Ichiro Honda, a renowned computer engineer and a luminary in his field. The other is a Devil Summoner named Aero. Sorry, Devil Summoner? The necessary information has already been provided to both of you, as well as abilities suited to your mission. And this is a... huh. I see. So this is what Devil Summoners used to fight. assume this mission will involve combat? Correct. Your new bodies have been adjusted for this eventuality. However, if your forms are damaged beyond our estimations... Then we could wind up dead, as much as any human would. Correct. You are accordingly advised to exercise caution in your investigation. Sheesh. Okay, fine. I call the Devil Summoner. Fig, you take the Engineer. Understood. Designating Ichiro Onda as Target Alpha, and Arrow as Target Beta. Mission status initialized. This will be Ion's first contact with the human world. Check. One, two. Ringo here. Currently en route to positional coordinates for target beta. What's the situation on your end, Fig? I was too late. Target Alpha, Dr. Ichiro Onda, has already been killed. Tell me. for starting things off right. Invoking emergency override. Self-regulation suspended. Self-check process suspended. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack.
systems are go. Agent now sampling the target soul's wave signatures. Complete. Soul sync. Complete. Process complete. <laughs> okay, let's see this soul of yours, Arrow. This is the only world we've got. No point wasting all our time moping about it, or turning into jerks. Yep, you're licensed. Now you're officially an agent of Yadagarasi. Congratulations, Hera. I know how hard you've worked to reach this point. Here we go. <sighs> this is my soul. What are you doing here? Oh, so you're aware, huh? Did you know you're dead too? I did. Didn't exactly go out peacefully, did you? Look. You just leave me alone. I'd like to spend my final moments in peace. So you're just gonna drown yourself in regret? How do you know about that? Well, I only know bits and pieces. I saw some stuff on my way down. So just what is it that you regret so badly? Who... Who are you? And why are you inside me like this? My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. An agent of... Ion is an eternal, unchanging, ultra-intelligent observer of the times born from the farthest reaches of technology. And the situation dictates that I have to look like a person right now because, you know, reasons. Wait, so... you're not human? This has gotta be a joke, right? Singularities typically occur outside of the public eye, but here's one right now, standing in front of you. Right. So why are you here? I'm here to bring you back. You're gonna help me prevent the end of the world. The end of the world? Very soon, your soul will disappear. And your chance at coming back will go with it. If we don't act now... So, come on, Arrow. You gonna help me stop this? Think of this as a second chance. Chance to get it right. <laughs> I... I can't let it end here. Ugh! <sighs>
<laughs> Welcome back. <sighs> Hello. You good in there? Soul back where it should be? You're... Ringo. You're... an agent of Ion. There we go. Glad that actually worked. Melody! Looks like we need a change of plan. Yo, man! Yo, yo, Arrow's here. Except you ain't no ghost. Arrest. Am I tripping, man? My boys told me you were straight up dead. If they cut your mic, stay off the stage, man. I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this clown. Who's he? They call me Rob Soldier, R to the yes. It ain't hyperbole, cause I can kill on the beat, representing the Phantom Society. Okay. That's it. That's the covenant. No way. Whoa, whoa. Step off, homie! Phantom's gonna need all those covenants! Only way we can rain some hell down on the whole world! We're going live! Your boy R.S., he's at the head of the pack! Proposers come at me and they don't come back! I drop that face like an earthquake! You throw hands with me, you made your last mistake! Let's go! Here we go. Careful, Ringo. That swagger's not a front. He's tough. They call me all rest cause I'm a dope MC. All my boys making noise in the COMP. So let's make this body count a one, two, three! Got the skills for the kills, cause they're genuine. Get what you get when you stop the landmine. Yeah, I'm the payoff, and you're the punchline! Got me. Kidding? I'm spitting gold bars. And your talk is cheaper. I'm the RS. And I don't fear no Reaper. I'm no Reaper, but I can send you to hell. So face the music, R.S., and take the L. Damn it! He had backup! Ringo! Fig! Ringo, what is this thing? To me? The Covenant's joining with you. Covenant? Then this was the point of Dr. Onda's message. Fig? Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. <laughs> Systems are go.
process complete. This is an unjust world. A false world. Let's destroy it together. beauty and so mournful too just like him sure you're the main squeeze of the man in the mask but you're endable expendable so hope you brought a casket oof zip talk about a fall rs has got you but you're back against the wall here. Not until I know the truth. <sighs> A lot easier the second time around. And you are? Relax, lady. You don't have to glare like that. My name's Rango. I'm an agent of Ion. I'm a super intelligent being born from the Sea of Information, and I'm here to stop the apocalypse. And what does this super intelligent being want with a dead woman? Well, Melody, how about I show you? Just come with me, and we'll go back. I'm dead, you simpleton. There's no going back. Why are you even here anyway? I'm gonna save the world. That's more than the world deserves. Okay, guess it's gonna take a little more than that. So that's it? This is where you die and you're okay with that? Because it sounded to me like you had something you still needed to do. You were running away. You want... So take my hand, Melody. And you can survive. You'll get one more chance to make things right. Hey, she's back! I guess it's true. Ion really is something else.
Impressive. I can't imagine how many security measures were in your way. You're no mere trespasser. Ichiro Anda, I presume. The greatest computer engineer of our time. It's a pleasure. And you are? I am the leader of Project C. You may call me Iron Mask. <laughs> a bit on the nose. Was Black Suit taken? Or are you a prisoner broken free? Well, it's fine. You're welcome to celebrate with me, Masked Man. So is your little wallflower. <sighs> it's complete. A system to shatter the status quo with a perfect name to shake the very foundation of Academe. The Omni System. Glorious, isn't it? Can't you feel its power? But now it's finished, and I'm done with it. If you're a thief, then go ahead and take it. You've designed a masterpiece, Doctor. The Omni System will uplift mankind to new heights. Alas, I'm afraid your part in our grand pageant ends here. We want something quite different from you. I should have known. If you don't want my creation, then you must be after me. Well, what dwells within me? You want the Covenant. Ah, you're already aware. You do know I'm a genius. <coughs> Say, masked man, one last tip. Call it. A parting gift from a genius. No one can control the future. Iron Mask. I have a future. Ichiro Anna, your covenant served you well, but it will serve me far better. On to the main topic. Melody, if you could go right. These are the five people the Phantom Society had marked. First is Iron Mask, leader of the Covenant Recovery Project, or Project C. He's a Covenant. The Covenant Recovery Project. How is the Phantom Society able to identify these individuals? A Covenant holder can detect another simply by looking at them. A quick glance in their direction is all it takes. Coupling that with the organization's power, the Phantom Society has been able to identify- Up next, we have Ichiro Onda, our late computer engineer. He held a covenant, but had no- Going off the security footage we just saw, his covenant is currently being- This means Iron Mask is in possession of at least two covenants at this time. The third covenant holder is a devil summoner, Mangetsu Kuzunoha. I imagine a certain someone here knows a lot more about him than I do, though. He's one of Yadagarasu's top devil summoners one of the key players in protecting the- There you have it. The fourth is a man named Saizo, who operates out of Karakacho. He's a freelance summoner. And lastly, our fifth covenant holder was me. Though that's clearly not the case anymore. That's the one I currently have. 
So many of them have switched owners in such a short time. It's kind of hard. Hang on a sec. Does that mean Iron Mask was targeting those two Covenant holders at once? If that's true, then the others could be in danger too. Milady, any idea where Saizo might be? Where it is, he's typically hanging around Bar Hydran about this time. Then that's where we gotta go. You coming, Fig? I'll wait here for everyone. If worse comes to worst, we can't- That said, you'll need an operator of sorts to appraise the situation. Roger. We'll let you handle things here then. Too late? Again? Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Systems are go. There. Are you still in one piece, miss? Thank you. <sighs> Come on. Is there anything behind all the smooth talk and one liners? Would you believe I've got a burning ambition to be a comedian someday? for you. Whoa. Never thought the Grim Reaper would be this cute. <laughs> I'm not a Reaper, man. Not even that grim. Actually, my name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. I'm trying to stop the end of the world. I came here to bring you back. So you're telling me this smooth-talking sweetheart who's out to save the whole world. You got it. What do you think, Saizo? Your story doesn't really end here, right? You've got some unfinished business. Damn right I do. I never got a chance to talk to her. I'll never have a real ending until I fix that. Okay, then I'll give you that second chance. Why not? I summon demons for a living anyway. I can handle a deal with the Grim Reaper. I said I'm not the Grim Reaper! Hey, check it out. Isn't that guy one of Phantoms? He was one of Phantom. Wonder if Mangetsu killed him. Kaburagi! Are you the guys who killed my pal here? Ah, 
forgive me. I failed you as a leader. Hey, been a while. Yeah, about time. You look good. Got a new fire in Getting shot in the head will do that. <laughs> well, look who's sorry to disappoint. Well, as much as I'd like to sit down and toss one back with you, that's just not in the cards, is it? Hate to interrupt here, but... Hmm? Something to say, miss? Can I convince you to give up on Mangetsu? Ringo! No, Arrow. Right now, Ringo's putting the mission first. It's a smart move. We already defeated a Devil Summoner working under you. Give up the chase for Mangetsu, and we'll avoid a fight. <laughs> Sorry, but no. He and I have unfinished business. I thought you might say that. You're right, though. This fight is pointless. I might get in trouble for putting Mangetsu on the back burner here, but this is about what I believe. And what is that? I believe in the righteousness of the Phantom Society. I believe that the world Phantom will create is the world I always dreamed of, ever since I was a kid. Even if it means I gotta kill a down and out bum to make it happen. Hmm. You want me to say it hurts? Sure, it hurts. None of us want to be out here killing innocents. I don't want to see a buddy get killed. And I sure as shit don't want to fight to the death with my best. But, the bigger the goal, the higher the price. Sometimes, you just... Mm. I made up my mind a long time ago. So I'm prepared to do even if it means selling your soul. Hang on a sec. Right, people might call that brainwashing. You might think I'm some phantom fanatic. But if you're not believing in something to the fullest, are you even really living? Your values, your faith? Words just aren't enough to make a difference. I have to agree with him, especially here. Too much blood has already been spilled. So we have to fight. This is about who we are. You follow me? Yeah. Avoiding conflict would be to deny the paths we've chosen. In my eyes, that's a fate worse than death. <sighs> Sheesh, you're stubborn. I've never met anyone so unnecessarily... <laughs> you hear that? That goes for you, too. <laughs> Come on. I'm not that... No, you both are. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> <laughs> Suppose we ought to get started, huh? Nah. This is the end, ain't it? Call it whatever you want. Been a long time coming. Whoever loses buys the first round. What do you say, huh? All right. Guess you're buying then. This is it, gang. Don't fail me now. Let's put my old pal in place! Don't 
Whatever it takes. It's not over. It's not over! You're wrong. It's over. <clears throat> Shit. Yes. Kaburagi! <laughs> you really showed me. You've been working hard. I have. But not enough. Not enough to fulfill our dreams like we wanted. Ain't that ironic. You and me... We both had all because we joined different teams. Look where that got us. Hey, Arrow. The world we want is the same. Right? Yeah. It is. No doubt about it. Good. That's... all I needed to hear. <sighs> oh, shit. Guess that beer... <laughs> I figured you'd show up eventually. I heard you killed Kaburagi, so it was only a matter of time. But I wasn't expecting Milady to be on... your... side. <sighs> Impossible! No. You gotta be... Hey, Ash. You okay? But I... I watched you... I was there when you... I saw you die! What the hell? Why... How are you still alive? Oh, yeah. I'm immortal. Forgot to mention. Even now, all you can do is joke? Are you that stupid? Must be. Zenin. He's mine. Time to die! I think not. <gasps> Say I expected better of you, Melody. Don't talk! Like you calm down! You trying to kill him? Of course! Careful, everyone. This guy's unbelievably strong. He's gonna tear us apart if we don't stay cool. Or he might just tear you apart in spite of it. I take it you were Iron Mask. Is that right?
That I am. You want to take that mask? The only face I have. Are you Melody's boyfriend? Hmm. How would you put it, Melody? <sighs> so what'd you do with Mongetsu? You certainly ask a lot of- Answer me. I have to commend his ability. There aren't many who could genuinely harm my Zoma. That's not an answer. Whose blood- I think you know. <sighs> no! All you had to do was kill him to get his covenant. You didn't have to go that far. Oh, but I did. As I said, he was remarkably powerful. So this is some kind of warrior's respect? No, I'd say it was a bit more pragmatic. More specifically, a contingency plan to counteract his resurrection. You clearly have the power to raise the dead. But I've wondered, is that power truly boundless? What if no physical body remained? And there it is. Sounds like Kuzunoha's very existence was an inconvenience. Now that he's finally dead, I would much prefer he stay that way. What did you do with Mongetsu? He was devoured. <sighs> You're a monster. A matter of perspective. You seem like more of a monster to me. You resurrect the ones I kill. You restore the data I purge. You've been quite a persistent thorn in my side. I'm flat. But no matter what miracles you work, no matter how hard you try, I am always one step ahead. Do you understand now? You can't stop me. You can't change fate. Say, Iron Mask, what's fate got to do with it? Why are you... You do realize you're only exposing your own ignorance. If you want to oppose me, you will do so on my terms. Zen in a bit of an outlier compared to Zoma. Ask him if you'd like a first hand. He just got me off guard. But yeah, this guy's bad news. I can tell that much. Go, Zen. Out of my way! <clears throat> We're definitely hitting him, and he's got to be feeling it. Think. Are you curious? You could say that. Then allow me to clarify. Okay. Why the hell should I? Because if this thing murders you, Iron Mask wins. You never get to kill. Definitely persistent. I can. Saiso. You're a hard lady to catch up to. Ugh. You're worse than a stalker. I don't want to fight you anymore. I don't. 
don't either. That's what I've been saying. Then why? How about you stop and tell me what's going on? What the heck? Would you shut up for once? Don't you get it? It's because I'm the reason you died! Zenin's the one who killed me. Don't lie to yourself. I let you in there. I'm the one who cut you. It was my fault. I couldn't believe I gave up on you. Gave up on trying to change this stupid, broken world. I didn't care. I knew that was what I deserved for betraying you. Killing you. If I stayed a summoner, then our karma would catch up with me sooner or later. That was how it was supposed to end. But now? But now you're alive again! Why? I killed you! I betrayed you! How could things between... <sighs> All you have to do is ask. Come on, Ash. I'll give us a clean slate if you- Damn it. I knew you'd say that. I knew you'd forgive me. This is exactly why you're so annoying. I'll come back for you. I promise. Just- your plan. Time you attack a good plan. What do you mean? Zen has already overcome. No. You're surprised? Do you even know why the Zoma would be weak? There's a reason? It's because their powers are designed to mirror a demons. So if he has the covenants to draw on instead, Precisely. Ash was kind enough to buy me all this time. But you make it sound like you knew we'd come here today. Why else would I allow myself to be spot? Hand over the Covenant. Never. I was addressed. <laughs> well, I know you're listening. <sighs> yes, I'm referring to you. The bearer of. <clears throat> no, Big! Don't listen to him! If we cannot settle this civilly, I have. That was your cue to scream. Try to find. Now, if I might have the drone. You can see that, can't you? A wound like that might not kill a human, but be Big! Don't listen to him! 
Your resolve is admirable. No fear at all. This body can perfectly simulate pain? I confess my curiosity is piqued. All right. Have you decided to give up the Covenant? I said all right. But I'm warning you. If you lay even a finger on them before I... Big! <sighs> Can you move, Saizo? Sorry. No dice. Shoot. I was thinking we could... Never heard Fig sound that pissed. Same here. Wow. So, she's got some... Yeah. Work with me, Saizo. We've got to do something about Yeah, I hear you. <laughs> I'm here, Iron Mask. As promised, I have not harmed them further. May I treat her? By all means. Are you okay, Ringo? I'm sorry, Fig. No. If anyone should apologize... This hurts, Fig. It'll heal up soon enough. No. You... There. That should do it. Fig! <sighs> now we talk terms. Don't get ahead of yourself. The co I'm aware. I'm making sure the conditions are... A noble sentiment. So you are... <sighs> Do you have any last words? No. But I have one question. Tell us why you're doing this. Well... I suppose... That doesn't tell us anything. If we don't under... <laughs> tell me. Why do you want the... You're so naive. Remember your pledge. Don't hurt Ringo and the others anymore. Eat up, Zen. That's it. The rainbow is complete. Finally. It's mine. <laughs> and now, the final curtain. What's wrong? All the pieces should be in place. Sorry, boss. Turns out karma's on my side. Fit! The demon's control is gone. Time to fight back! Huh? Fig, you're... alive? I'll explain later. It appears that the tables have turned. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> so, I'm caught in your trap now, am I? Well, if you think hiding from me will save your friends, then you can watch me rip them apart! with the Covenants. Hey, we still managed to beat Zenon. I'd call but more importantly. What's going on? Fig? Thank you, Ash. You gave us the opening we needed against Iron Mask. Not a big deal. I was just doing my own. Even so, thank you for being... Fig! You don't have to shout, Ringo. Then don't just ignore me! I prioritize thanking Ash. I suspect that... Fig... You don't have to hold on to that box. Then... What is... It's a remotely controlled proxy. You could say I took some... You actually made the bit. Yes. Do you recall my first operation as Mimi when- Yeah. I Ever since then, I've been working on this plan to end- Why? Because of the Covenant. I anticipated that continuing to travel unguarded with a Covenant at stake to mitigate that risk, I had the idea to create another body. Without telling me? Without telling you. Come on, guys. Let's focus on the fact that Fig's- Hey, Fig. Your covenant seemed to zap away Zen. I knew you'd be up against a powerful foe. With the worst case scenario- All on your own? Zenin was using the covenants to amplify his already considerable- Yeah, I think Victor- Right. And that connection, between- With that in mind, I concocted a virus with the sole purpose of set- Both were then transferred into the decoy body, which I- And when he took the covenant from you- There was no way to prove it would work. Wow. I mean, sir- <sighs> Well, I couldn't risk besides which. It... I don't want modesty, lady. Some answers would be great. That means he has all of them, doesn't it? That's not a problem, Arrow. Iron Mask's the situation is still dire. But Iron Mask is all that has to be a significant blow to his ambition. But then, where's the last... I've already identified the bearer of the final... How? I managed to extract that information from... But before we discuss that further... Guys, how you doing? Made any progress? <laughs> Hi, Raven. Actually, we might have figured out some things about. <sighs> uh, hello? You. That conversation is. Over. What? Arrow, what's going on? I said we're done! Huh. 
Let's go home. Hey. Sorry, Raven. I'll... I'll come back late. Yeah. I'll be waiting. I'm back. Good to see you. Fig, did you get the Purple Covenant? <laughs> Let's go to Komodori, Ringo. Maybe I should go too. I understand how you feel, Fig. But if they take you out while you're carrying the Covenant, <sighs> you can support us with Mimi. I understand. I'm sorry to have forced this on you, Fig. Please, protect. Raven. I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you either, damn it! I'm not gonna let you do this! Melody! Do the rest of you even care about stopping the apocalypse? Our enemy can't go all out here either. We need every advantage we can get. We're even surrounded by potential hostages we can use against him. Don't, Melody. They've got nothing to do with this! Maybe they don't. The kids are innocent. But that's never meant a damn thing to the world. Why should it matter to me? This is an unjust world. I'm sorry. <laughs> but you are. Man, this is what I get for having summoner friends. You make me look well adjusted. Raven. All right, everybody, back to bed now. But... Come on. I'll be okay, Ichika. Um... Thank you, Melody. <sighs> no running or hiding? Not even any traps? You don't feel threatened at all, do you? So? Where- The West Shipping District. Got it. You know who I am. And you know what you-
You actually went to the trouble of dressing up. That'll make this easier on us, too. Raven, please just back down. I don't want to fight you. Thick. She's got a point. I think you should give up too. Humility. But what? Don't get me wrong. I hate you for what you did to the man I love. I've been waiting a long time for my chance to kill you. But I know those kids couldn't take losing you. It'd break them. All you have to do is give us the covenants, and I'll back down. Don't give me that, Melody. I thought you wanted to avenge him. Or was he really nothing to you after all? So, you really did kill him then? Yes. My own two hands. Fortune favored me, but not by much. If our luck had been a little different, I'd have died. And he'd have walked away. I see. And that's when you took the Covenant? Yes. When the Blue Covenant left his body, it was absorbed by the Zoma he'd been keeping. That's when I took all the research relating to the Covenants and the spell sequence to control Zenon. Why would you do that? What are you trying to do? Please, I want a real answer this time. I want to end the fighting. For good. The Great One must put an end to the chaos. It's the only way. Raven, what the hell are you talking about? Think about it. If we can't get rid of the Covenants, then it's only a matter of time. The fact that it's going to be okay. The Great One won't take everyone's souls. The next generation of humanity will survive. Whoever gathers the Covenants and invokes the Great One has the power to- Is that actually true? It's what everyone in the Phantom Society's told. If Raven stole the original's research, that's probably where he got the idea. Exactly. That's why I need the Covenants. I'm going to end all of this. I want those kids to have a future. What about Arrow's sacrifices? He's been fighting for the same reasons you are this whole time. He killed his best friend for that future. I... You think this is going to redeem you? Do you seriously think the kids would want this? I don't know, but at least they'll survive. What the hell else could I have done? Why didn't you tell me? And so look at me! I don't even know what I'm fighting. It's too late for me to turn back now. No. I see. I guess there's only one thing left to do. Together, Arrow. He's made his choice. We need you to fight. I know it's hard, but she's right. Here and now, you two need to put an end to this once and for all. 
And I'll stick with you no matter what. Let's finish this! God damn it! So long, Raven. Do me a favor and keep him company when you get to where you're going. All right? Arrow. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sequence, soul hack. All systems are go. I'm not going to let you die. too. Sure. Let's go outside. This is it. If I've got this, I can at least protect the kids. If destruction is inevitable, then I'll... Wait for me, everyone. I swear, I'll do it.
Fig. Can't say I expected to see you here. I had no idea you carried such a difficult past. No, difficult doesn't even begin to describe it, does it? Oh. So you can see that kind of stuff in here, huh? I fought hard as a devil summoner for Yadagarasu. I believed everything was for our vision. It had brought me to do a lot of things I'm not proud of. But when I killed that poor kid, a part of me was completely shattered. <sighs> Looking back, it's clear I was just too weak. I didn't have the strength needed to realize my vision. But if you knew that, then why? Why didn't you turn to someone for help? You didn't have to shoulder it all on your own. I don't know. <sighs> Couldn't tell you. Don't give up, Raven. Take my hand. You still... It's all right. I knew I was wrong to do what I did. I just, the moment I cast away my beliefs and took up that mask, I was already dead. But I've seen you when you're with those kids. No mask could ever hide that. The real you is still alive in there. Thank you, Vic. You and your friends are right. So don't give up. Stay on that path no matter how hard it might be. And you'll find what you're looking for. No! You can't stay here anymore. Go back to the others. I'm not leaving you here! They can't make it today. Is that okay? What Fig needs now is rest. She was extremely lucky. Failing a soul hack could have resulted in far worse than a coma. Sure enough. So what's going on? Ion has foreseen a new future. I mean, we got all the covenants. I'd be panicking if the future didn't change. I guess that means our mission's complete.
Hey, you must be doing a lot better if you're up and on your feet, huh? That's great. Still we were all really worried about... <sighs> What's wrong, Fig? Are you still not feeling good? It's all right, though. We saved the world and everything, so now we can just take our time with the Covenants, you know? <laughs> take our time. Sounding more human every day. <sighs> hey, come on. Say something. Is no longer here. Fig assimilated all of Ion into her will, excluding you and me. She then set off for the 24th Ward Municipal Tower. If you wish to speak to her, I advise- You didn't go with Fig? I have my own purpose within this system. You are likewise an incarnation. Otherwise, it wouldn't be fair, would it? Thanks, Flemma. waiting for you to show up. Who are you? The name's Hozumi. I suppose you could say I'm Yadagarasu's insurance for when the Kuzunoha's grand designs don't work out. Ring a bell? No. Well, they call me the Shadow. But my Yadagarasu assignments were probably <laughs> a little above your pay grade. I take it your arrow. I'm taking over your mission. I have an official letter of delegation from command right here. It says I've got to collect the Covenants in your place. You want the Covenants? Essentially, I'm here to kill that Ion vessel, Fig. Get the impression holding back would be a bad idea. So the plan is any means necessary. This outsider. Outsider, wow. Maybe I haven't been clear. This what? Raven was our guy, and he was at the center of these incidents. Yeah, so it's about accountability. Badagarasu cleans up and two birds with one stone. We fix this problem, pin down the You vultures didn't care about accountability before. So that's how the world works. Come on, man. Look, Hosumi. Is this that all depends? I'd like to formally join Yatagarasu. It doesn't matter whether you're on Yatagarasu's side or the Phantom Society's side. Oh, no? The sides are the whole reason the violence never stops. You have no idea what you're talking about. And if... <laughs> so then... You didn't hear me the first time? I want you out... Well, now. How about you, Ara? Remember that opposing me means opposing the will of Yatagarasu. Casting aside your whole purpose. I don't need orders to tell me what my purpose is here. So I see. <laughs> well, that's all I needed to hear. Well, I could use a one. Couldn't hurt to get some experience against a lesser agent of Maya. Fine then. You clearly have some noble ideals. Let's test them.
Okay, you win. Then... What? Waiting for an invitation? Ringo, Emissary of Ion. What happens if you can't con- Are you gonna keep talking to her? Would you risk the entire world to save one friend? Of course. I'll never- <laughs> You realize that? Yeah, it's irrational. Un well, at least you're self-aware. Then hang on tight to those ideals. That's a makeover. Why have you come here? I came to talk. Talk? Uh, Just tell us, Fig. What are you trying- uh, I'm going to end the violence. <laughs> I'm going to soul hack the entire human race. I'll end- What are you talking about? I thought soul hack- No. Soul hacking- It's- The power to re- Soul hacking alters a person's very core. Did you think the hack- We got sliced up? Why did all of you accept the will of Aya? Ringo could have easily written that acceptance into your very souls. You I didn't do that! I don't care if she did. What's important is the time we had together. If you're trying to divide us, you're wasting your time. Hey, my trust was my own. I was the one who decided I'd take a chance on you guys. Guys... Your mutual faith is truly, genuinely beautiful. Soul hacking will uplift both mankind in accordance with Ion's vision of our united future. I will do what I must to allow our path and humanities to converge. I will hack the thirst for conflict out of humanity's collective soul. In time, humans will subconsciously come to understand one another. And thus, all co and that's how you're going to end this world. No, Ringo. It is a new beginning. The dawn of an era in which humanity and Ion may walk the same path. Come on. You're trying to remake all of humanity? Don't tell me you're gonna go around hacking everybody one by- She's not. That's what she needs her tech for. That's right. The Omni system doesn't just reduce data transfer time. It's instantaneous. A person's soul is defined by a massive amount, but this system will make that possible. It only allows me to access devices with an on- By their very nature, the Covenants of- And you intend to lure the in- If I unlock Ion's full operate from their theoretical model. So you want to route the power of the Covenants through- That's- Isn't that exactly what you- Listen, Fig. Is that really our only option to- If you do this, Fig, all human hearts will be equalized. Is that really what you want? I know. You're trying to remove the source of humans. It's one of the things that drew us to them in the first place. It's- I know that! I was there with you. I saw the same things you did. But still, even this would be better than a future of endless pain. Is that what you came all this way to say? Look, Fig. It doesn't have to be- There has to be another way. I know we can find it. I don't want to fight you, Fig. I've made my choice! I knew this would be hard. I knew it sparked more conflicts. I know a contradiction when I see one. But even in the face of that contradiction, you all fought for what you believed in. So I will do the same. All right then. You said you came to talk. Nope. If you're going to force your will on everyone, I'll stop you. 
Even if I have to fight, that's what a friend would do. So be it. One final pain. The last in this world. One last sorrow. For me and for you. their entire conscious so get ready team you must be hungry
Our summoning powers came back too. I wonder if it's because the Axis fell. Who knows? Eh, you got a point about the Axis. What about the mean- After all that's happened, I'm surprised none- Well, that's because it's being kept- Seems like Yadagarasu is doing a good job of keeping eye with- Phantom doesn't seem to want to stand out either. <laughs> At least the two of them can agree- Then again, even if it all went public, I'd- Singularities occur outside the public eye. Hmm? Mm. She's been like this the whole time. You can't really blame her. Not after- <sighs> Oh yeah, what's up with the Covenants? Yadagarasu doesn't seem to have any information- Same goes for Phantom. They've been scrambling to- f So they disappeared. That or some- Makes me wonder. Well, a fight's not over so long as there's still someone- Anyhow, I'd love to stay and hang, but I gotta head out. Ash is waiting for me. It's a shame your summoning days are behind you. The fan- Hey, Melody, don't be trying to beat a- Give me a break, guys. It's kind of you, but I'm gonna- If you two start killing each other, do me a- See you around, Ringo. Was one. Hmm. See ya. What's wrong, Ringo? Are you lonely or something? <laughs> You're acting like a lost little girl. Huh? No, I'm not lonely. Oh no? All right, I guess- Believe me, I'm with you. Goodbye, Ringo. So long, Melody. I should probably head out myself. Thanks for everything. After Kaburagi, Dr. Mangetsu, Raven. I probably would have lost it a long time ago if not for you. Mm. If you ever need anything, just call. I'll be there. And that's not on Yadagarasu's behalf. Yeah. Figure that's now. I wonder what the kids will be hungry for. After the battle at the Municipal Tower, I was the only piece of Ion that had survived. The only piece that was left. Fig and the rest of Ion ended up disappearing once all was said and done. I watched them fade away into the night wind. All that remained was their core data, twinkling away as if it were nothing more than Christmas lights. I haven't set foot in the Axis since then. It's actually kind of hard. Now that Flam was gone. And besides, even with the core data, I'm not a true agent of Ion anymore. My body's been optimized to function as a human. I can't restore Ion by myself. I've more or less lost my identity with Ion at this point, but I'm not all that human either. Gotta say, Feels like I'm stuck in some kind of limbo. 
still, in spite of all that, I've been given something special. And if humanity continues to grow as they have, I believe Ion will return someday. And when the time comes, it'll be my job to tell them just how incredible humans really are. How they're infinitely foolish, yet beautiful, all the same. That's why I'm gonna make the most of my time here caught in this qualia prison. Just like they do. At least until that day. Until that day, I see Fig again.